Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Arif Hakimi bin Azmi and I will be presenting about the introduction and also the background for this project. Without further ado, I would start. Okay, for the introduction, the groups are tasked to develop an AR for car parts. So what we have done is that our group chose a four-cylinder inline engine as the design. And what you can expect from our group is that the fundamental parts within the engines are to be displayed and also the moving parts are also included inside this augmented reality. Okay, for the background of this project, first we chose a design which is a four-cylinder inline engine. And for the fabrication of the design, each member utilize solid work. After finishing the designs, we developed the augmented reality for the AR development. Two specific applications have been used, softwares to be exact, which is Unity and Vuforia. What Unity is, Unity is a development software that provides the necessary tools to create the AR. Okay, after the development has been performed in Unity, it is then transferred to Vuforia where the AR, the augmented reality, is being realistically produced so that it would interact with the objects and also the environments. What's so good about this is that the functionality of the AR is specific to the designs, which means that it's flexible. And to display the AR, you just have to scan the QR codes that have been produced using any AR apps that is available on the market right now. My name is Abdul Mohamin bin Muhammad Daud and I want to explain about the objective of the product. The objective of the product is first, it can reduce cost and time during assembly process. It also utilizes the AR in the automotive industry. Besides that, it also increases the efficiency of design and fabrication process. Next, I want to talk about the advantages of the product. The 4-cylinder inline 4 is small and compact, meaning it easily fits in nearly any engine bay. Next, it's also like wake, and with only one exhaust manifold, wake is further reduced. The other advantage is, with only one cylinder head, there are fewer moving parts than engines with multiple cylinder banks. This means less energy is lost, which reduces the probability of malfunctions. Next, the primary forces are balanced because the outside two pistons move in the opposite direction of the inside two pistons. Next, the four cylinder engines are easy to work on. The cylinder head is the highest point which makes spark plug jobs and valve train access very easy. Lastly, the four cylinder engines require lower manufacturing costs. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Sarah Shahib bin Sarah Saleh. Today, I'll be presenting the methodology of this project. Step number one, design the product module in SOLIDWORKS. In this project, we choose motor engine as our product. Step number two, simulate the product module by arrange the keyframe timeline in Blender software. Step number three, open Vuforia developer portal website to get license key and select the image target by creating the database. As in this project, we choose the image of the engine as our tracker. Step number four, open Unity Hub software, go to AR hierarchy and open Vuforia engine configuration to paste license key. Step number five, drag the database and product module into asset section of the Unity Hub. Step number six, select the product module and drag into children of image target. Step number seven, adjust the scale of the product module, which is engaged properly for visualize on the screen application. Step number eight, create a new plane object as background of video player. As you can see, 3D object. And then we go to the plane. Step number nine, select the video explanation of engine from desktop, drag into the previous plane object. Step number 10, attach the scripting into the plane object. 
for prevent error while playing. Tab number 11, add button features for animate the product module. Tab number 12, attach the scripting into the button as command input to play the animation while detecting the image target. Tab number 13, add the text for instruction of application. Tab number 14, go to player setting, choose the Android platform and create the APK file for run the application. I think that's all for me for today. Thank you. Hello, my name is Zuhazi Ayman bin Ramli and I will show on how to use Cars Engine applications. But before that, bear in mind that this application was invented to broaden the knowledge in automotive world. These apps will give a clear image on engine working principle. These apps will give a clear image on how the working principle of Cars Engine. Firstly, install the Cars Engine applications on your camera equipped device such as smartphone, tablet or laptop. And wait for the installing process. Next, after the installation process is complete, open the applications. Here, the apps uh, will ask to access the user's camera, then click Allow. There are a few symbols or signs can be seen from the user interface now, such as prompt to scan the car's engine and a button to animate the pistons. Next, user must face the camera to the car's engine. Since this is the only demonstration phase for this application, we just use printed image of car's engine. Once the system has detected the image, the user now should see two 3D virtual designs of car's engine. The left one is the interior parts of the car's engine, while the right one is the full covered of the car's engine. Furthermore, there also will be a video presentation about the car's engine placed in between of the two 3D virtual designs of car's engine. To increase the understanding of the user on how the car's engine is working, user can press the animate piston button. This will move the pistons and show on how the actual car's engine looks when it is working. User also can zoom in or out the engine by only pinch the image using two fingers. With the invention of these applications, we believe it will give a knowledge in interactive and ergonomic way. Thus, it also will give awareness to the society about the importance to take care of their car's engine. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi ta'ala wabarakatuh and a very good day to everyone. My name is Raja Muhammad Amir Al-Ishraq bin Raja Azmin and I would like to present my part about the suggestion on one industries. There are various ideas that this AR technology and its application can be implemented in industries for a better option and solution based on our chosen product, which is four-cylinder inline gasoline engine. First and foremost, our AR product can be applied in the automotive industry as our product is very closely related to this industry. People that often handle this product such as mechanic, engineer and technician can have a faster response in terms of inspection, recognize the subpart inside the engine without having a separate any outside part or housing of the engine by using augmented reality. Also, there are the automotive industry may see this as a chance uh, to teach new employees in their companies about the minor parts involved in detail, making it easier to inspect in the event that maintenance is required. Secondly, this concept is well suited for the manufacturing industry 
where augmented reality can be particularly useful in the manufacturing process and inventory management. As we can see, the advantage of our AR solution can assist system in increasing product production rate and human productivity. This project, for example, can be loaded immediately on this computer, providing detailed information on the model, such as dimensions, dynamic movement, and animation. Furthermore, in this industry, the AR product can make it uh, easier for operators to correctly manage inventory for production, as they will save time checking inventory for each part involved in a four-cylinder inline gasoline engine on a real item and in a real environment. Next, we will look uh, at the next industry in which this AR product can, could be used, which is engineering education. As we all know, <coughs> there is a specific elective subject in the Mechanical Engineering Faculty syllabus. As a result, this chance can be used to provide the best possible understanding of the engine for education knowledge. Aside from that, the lecturer or teacher does not need to explain the components of the engine to their students with a physical object of the engine in front of them, or they do not need to visit a workshop or factory. Instead, they can have a simulated experience of the actual model engine during class session only by using uh, the application on the software of the smartphone. Last but not least, the research and development sector can be associated with AR product as engineers can easily improve the design development of existing engine products in a better environment. Regarding to their job on uh, performing uh, research and testing on product, the product concept typically in office, they can use the AR product to increase the navigation systems and enhance vehicle safety in order to provide high quality product. This AR technology can be assessed through the specific motion and complex compartment that can be handled uh, via its software in order to provide uh, high quality product that beneficially for R&D engineer to, to recreate a better imagination.